a slow concentric squat, a great way of saying just go really slow on your way up. So we're going to go a little bit faster on the way down, take a pause, and then really slow out of the hole for control, kind of creating that force production off the ground. So if you're someone that can bounce in and out of the squat really fast, then I want you to kind of get to that mid-range position and really slow it down. This can be really helpful um, for if you're a little bit more hypermobile, just really thinking about that force production and generating that power from the ground. So I'm holding my double out here, or I can hold that goblet hold position. Either way, I want my sternum lifted, my ribs back, kind of thinking about bringing my center mass back. I'm going to think about coming down, coming to about mid-range, sternum lifted. I want to make sure I'm not overly tucking or overly extending through my low back. So I'm thinking about allowing myself to come down, and then really slow to come back up. So we're focusing on that concentric, which is that coming up part of the squat. So it's a little bit more yielding-ish on the way down and kind of almost really going kind of fast. Exhale. Nice and slow on the way up. Play around with the breath and how it feels for you. You can inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale up. Once again, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Whatever feels good to you from the breathing standpoint, we can integrate some pelvic floor work in there. Really thinking about that push up of pressure and that slow ascent out of the 